A Pike County man is facing a felony arson charge after he allegedly set a fire in a hospital bathroom. 23-year-old Tristan Ryan Blair of Regina was arrested Thursday morning. Pikeville Police and Fire responded to a call of a fire in a bathroom at Pikeville Medical Center just after midnight Thursday. There they found a garbage can that had been set on fire and paper towels placed over a fire alarm. Court documents say a review of video surveillance footage shows Blair enter and then exit the bathroom just before the fire was discovered. We got a suspect that, had, that we seen go into the bathroom and come out of the bathroom. Uh, officers continued to search throughout the night for that suspect. Um, he was located this morning uh, in downtown Pikeville and uh, an interview was conducted and he was subse subsequently arrested. At this point we don't know what his motive to uh, set a fire in a, a setting such as a hospital would be. It was on the first floor in one of the first floor bathrooms. There was quite a bit of, of what appeared to me there's going to be quite a bit of cleanup and quite a bit of damage to repair. In my opinion, any time that there's a fire in such a place as a, a medical facility like the Pipewell Medical Center, you know, because uh, you've got some medical grade equipment, you've got oxygen and things of that nature in use in there, uh, and you've also got a, a vast majority of people that are concentrating to that area. Uh, so any time that something like that happens, uh, it does uh, create great concern for those inhabitants of the building. Um, particularly those you know those people that are there for medical care um, so yeah with the, a lot of the things that are used there and the, and some of the people that are already being sick um, that does create a, a risk to those people no one was injured in the incident blair was charged with first degree arson and was lodged in the pike county detention center where he's being held on a ten thousand dollar cash bond court documents say blair denied having any knowledge of the fire being set